Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Just a quick video today covering important news coming out of the This Week at Bungie vlog post. Apart from discussing patches and fixes to weapons, we're looking at you Prometheus Lens. It also brought news of the next version of the Faction Rally. Season 2's first Faction Rally will commence on the 12th of December. This time, ornaments will be available for the armour already earned in the Faction Rallies. And these will be obtained by completing specific challenges much like the Vanguard and Crucible armour ornaments already in the game. So we also get a look at the winner's offerings which will be available for the winning faction of the Faction Rally. So we have the Hollow Earth Auto Rifle from Dead Orbit. This is a Vice Energy Auto Rifle and will come with Zen Moment for added stability and ricochet rounds. There's then the Doubt kinetic auto rifle from the future war cult much like the iron banner season one auto rifle forward path and it will come with high caliber rounds and snapshot sights last up is the logutor 4 kinetic auto rifle from new monarchy it's a hack a auto rifle with ricochet rounds and high impact reserves all are viable offerings in my opinion but with so many good auto rifles at the moment in Destiny 2, it's tough to say if any of these will be worthwhile, but I'm going to go out on a limb and say the future war cult offering is the best out of the bunch here. So there we go, just a quick recap of what is to come in Season 2's first faction rally starting next week on the 12th of December. Please let me know what you think of this upcoming faction rally, and if you are still enjoying the Curse of Osiris DLC. I for one know that Destiny 2 is not in the greatest place at the minute, but it does show signs of promise and I'll be sticking with it anyway, so in the meantime, let me know what your thoughts are in the comments section below. Remember to also like and subscribe for more future Destiny 2 content, find me on Twitch and also follow me on Twitter. Thanks for watching, cheers.